Indonesia is a country with a million natural resources in it. There are many natural potentials that not have been fully utilized. Every day we have an incident that causes it injured. One is a damage to the skin integrity that occurs when the skin is exposed to temperature or pH, chemicals, friction, pressure trauma and radiation. Mostly, we use antiseptic, iodine providin, or synthetic medicine to heal the wound. In addition to synthetic medicine, there are also herbal medicine that are still under recognized. The development of herbal medicine as an alternative treatment continues. Herbal medicine have many excess in between, have large side effects, and compared to synthetic drugs, should be easy to get, effective, eliminates the search of disease. On the other hand, we know that Indonesia is rich of plants, including Binahong and Bajaka. Binahong and Redera's cannons alnok is empirically used for heal various wounds. The ethanol extract from Binahong leaf had activity as anti-burn injury and also has anti-inflammatory activity. Well, Bajaka Tampala is an herbal medicinal plant which all part of it can be utilized. These plants are genus from Kalimantan province. The bajaka plant is one of the plants which is used as traditional medicine by Kalimantan residents to cure various types of diseases and restore stamina during activities. Bajaka and Binahong are well known for being able to cure various diseases, but the fact that nanoparticles can increase the effectiveness of the two herbs of professional get enough attention. Nanoparticle is some particle of matter between 1 until 100 nanometers in diameter. The advantages of nanoparticle is can penetrate the spaces between cells. So it's hope when the nanoparticle concept is applied, the effectiveness level of the extract can increase. Accordingly, we are proud to present our research entitled Study of the effect by Jaka and Binahong combination in the open wound healing based on nanoparticles. My name is Kinasa Safira Krasnaati and my name is Naila Fatmalatifa Astia Putri. We are from SMA Negeri 3 Semarang. This research was conducted to the first stage. The first is stage of making extract from Binahong and Bajaka. Second, combining the extract of Binahong and Bajaka. Third is stages of doing nanification process, PSA test, and physicamical test. And fourth last is herbal medicine testing stage on mice. Material and tools we need are Before we explain our method, we would like to inform you that we divide the mice into four groups. Group 1, the group that given a combination of extracts bajaka root and binahang leaf in a nanoparticle form with a ratio of 1 to 1, 3 tails of mice. Group 2, the group that given a combination of extracts bajaka root and binahong leaf in a nanoparticle form with a ratio of 1 to 2, 3 tails of mice. Group 3, the group that given a combination of extracts bajaka root and binahong leaf in a nanoparticle form with a ratio of 2 to 1, 3 tails of mice. And group 4, the group was not given any extract. 3 tails of mice. On the first stage, we do two extraction process. The first is Binahang extraction and the second is Bajaka extraction. Binahang extraction process started from preparing 250 gram of Binahang powders, putting on 250 gram Binahang leaf powders on the blender. Mixing two liters of aqueous gradually by degrees until not too thick and separating the extract between drugs and water. Just take the water and throw away the drugs. Bajaka extraction process started from preparing 6 pieces of bajaka roots and 2 liters of water, pour 2 liters of water into the pan and wait until it boils. 
put six pieces roots in a pot and boil for 30 minutes until the water color turning becomes dark red. Strain the drugs and remaining roots of the pirates. Just take the liquid part. Second process is making combination from two extract of both. Preparing the extract of the root of the pejaka and the extract of the pinal leaf, then preparing the 200 ml volume bottle, mixing the extract according to the predator minus ratio, namely 1 to 1, 1 to 2, 2 to 1, into the 200 ml volume bottles provided. For the process of doing the notification are Prepare the ultra certification tool, fill the tool using water until it covers the sample, insert the bottle into the tool, turn on the tool, start the notification process for one hour. We also do some PSA test and physicamical test to prove that our particle size is nano and to check the ingredients in our extract. This is the result of physicamical test. And for the last is the application process to the mysis. The stage lasted for 2 weeks or 14 days. After being applied for 2 weeks, we got some results. Here are. From the analysis and results, it can be concluded that 1. The combination of bajaka root extract and binahang leaf extract in the form of nanoparticle can be used as an alternative to healing cuts because they contain mayor alkaloid, dragon dove alkaloid, steroid, and tannins. 2. The most optimal composition of the combination of extracts of bajaka root and binahang leaf in the form of nanoparticle is a ratio of 2 to 1, and the composition that was least optimal was the composition of extract from the roots of bajaka and binahang leaf in the form of nanoparticle with a ratio of 1 to 1. 3. The combination of extracts of the roots of bajaka and binahong in the form of nanoparticle is effectively used as a healer for cuts. Now for our research, thank you for your attention, sorry for our mistake. And don't forget to support us on Indonesian Science Project Olympia 2023 by liking and sharing this video. Thank, thank you and goodbye!